Proxima b is the closest habitable exoplanet we have discovered. It orbits a red dwarf star, called Proxima Centauri. In comparison to the Sun, Proxima Centauri is much smaller. So, it emits less energy than our Sun. That's why it has continuance of trillions of years. But our Sun only has 5 billion years left to become a red giant. Now, let's imagine a scenario in which the Earth gets destroyed before the Sun engulfs it. In order to survive or save humanity from extinction, we must have some plans to settle on an exoplanet. And for that, Proxima b would be our first preference, as it is the closest to the Earth. Like the Earth, it also lies in Proxima Centauri's habitable zone. That means there is a high probability of the presence of liquid water and a bearable surface temperature. And if we are lucky enough, Proxima b would have an atmosphere suitable for humans to breathe. But, before all of these calculations, we must have that technology to start our journey to Proxima b. Our destination is 4.3 light years away from us. And if we started our journey with current technology, it would take thousands of years to get there. So, we have to design a spaceship for interstellar travel, including a new navigation system, a hibernation system, and life support systems. But even after completing all these tasks, sending humans on a mission like this is a huge risk. Because spaceflight could be very dangerous. We can't say that everything would go smoothly and we would reach our destination. A simple mistake or a malfunction could fail our entire mission. Even if everything goes as planned, the harsh environment of space would have a deep impact on travelers' mental and physical health. And if somehow we could make babies in space with the help of science and technology, they would also be drastically affected by the hazardous environment of space. Genetic diversity would also occur amongst them. So their physiology would be completely different. It also might happen that we would arrive at a frozen planet. And even if it has an atmosphere, it might not be perfect for us. Or Proxima b could be tidally locked to Proxima Centauri. Recently, a new study was conducted to develop a model of the solar wind emanating from Proxima Centauri, using high-resolution maps of the magnetic field of the star. It was found that Proxima b receives about 1,000 times more solar wind radiation than the Earth does. This would make it extremely difficult for the planet to host an atmosphere and contain liquid water. Therefore, we can't be sure if this planet is habitable or not. But technology is constantly improving. A program called Breakthrough Initiatives is looking at how we can reach Proxima Centauri within one generation. Their project, Starshot, is working on an ultralight, unmanned probe that would reach the star system in just 20 years. And I really wish that someday humanity would make it to the stars. Hope you enjoyed the video. Sound off in the comments and make sure to like share and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.